Recently, I received a comment, Clownfish voice changer doesn't work on Windows 11. Why? Well, I don't know why it's not working for you, but here's how you can install it on your PC without encountering any issue. Before installing, make sure that your PC is up to date, drivers and Windows update to the latest version. Now, in case of drivers, make sure you can update your uh, audio drivers by using CC Cleaner. I have already uploaded a lot of videos on drivers, like how to update your uh, official drivers related to audio and graphic drivers. Graphic drivers, it is not much compulsory for, uh, you know, Clownfish voice changer, but audio driver is important. You need to update your audio driver first. I will provide the tutorial link in the description so you can check it out how to update your audio drivers and furthermore I will show you how to update your windows quickly just click on the windows icon and then search for settings and then open open it now on the left side you need to scroll down and you will get here the windows update just click on that and make sure update your windows by clicking on the check for updates and if there is any update related to your windows make sure update it first you can use any browser and then search for clownfish voice changer and on the top you will see here the clownfish voice changer just go on this website now after uh, on the clownfish website you will see here the download button just click on that and once you click on that you will see here the download version v1.81 currently is uh, v1.81 Maybe when you are checking this video, maybe there's a new version uh, available for downloading. Anyways, now here you need to focus Windows um, for specific Windows edition and architecture. Now it's available for download 64-bit, 64-bit, 32-bit. Now the VST, VST basically sound effects that you can install later and for 32 vst you can download for 32 version vst and for 64 vst you can use the 64 vst and for 32 window and for 32 vst so that's how it's work right now i'm going with the 64 bit uh, version because i'm using a uh, 64 bit operating system so just click on that and you'll get here the download file around 1.26 mb just click on the start download then open it once you here just click on next just click on next once again uh, you can choose the specific destination a folder uh, in my case i guess c is fine and then click on next once again click on install now here is the main question do you want to continue this operation Real Tech Audio Universal Service will be stopped if we click on yes. So maybe you can't hear me after pressing Y. But after finishing this installation, you can simply restart your PC and your problem should be fixed. Alright, after pressing Y, now it's done. Just click on next once again and then finish. Now it's working. Now, uh, first you need to launch uh, your clownfish. Sorry, the... Recorder uh, is pop up. Anyways, now after launching the Clownfish, you will see here the Clownfish voice changer icon. Just right click on it and make sure it's turned on. Currently, it's turned on, but if you turn it off, it will be like black and white. When you turn it on, it will be look like this. And now the thing is, first we will check here here microphone. So you can hear your microphone, and while hearing your sound, you can adjust further settings now maybe you guys okay you 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 can't hear my voice currently it's a glitch i need to restart my pc first and then it will work but the thing is we need to adjust a few settings go into the settings system integration and then here you need to find your microphone actually right and then click on install all right now it's working let me close this uh, background lights uh, sorry white okay 
Now the thing is, uh, maybe after installing the exact microphone from integration settings, it will not work because just you need to select here your default microphone on your exactly uh, the microphone that you are currently using. So after selecting that mic, it will work. So yeah, that's it. If you have any question, please let me know in the comment section. If you like today's videos, please like and subscribe to Windows Fixer as you know. We are working on suggested topic. Thanks for watching and supporting. See you later.